Hello everyone, welcome to Alan Ali's channel. Uh, today's special guest is Zabin Muri. He is the founder of Zabin Muri Design. In the year 2017, he officially started his journey as a jewelry designer. I really wanted to share his story with all of you because it is very unique. Uh, there are very few uh, men uh, jewelry designers out there. Uh, and irrespective of what uh, uh, the society will say, he continues to turn tables and he continues to do what he needs to do. And that in itself is very empowering. And also uh, through his life uh, or through his journey, uh, he reminds all of us that talent is not defined by gender. So let us take a quick uh, sneak peek into his work and also his journey. And after which we'll go into the interview segment. Hi Alan, thank you so much for having me here on your channel. And hello everyone, my name is Sabin Muri. I make jewelry and I sell online. I have a label called Sabin Muri Design, which is a collection of handmade jewelry like earrings, necklace, brooches, etc. You guys can check out in Instagram. I hope you would like it. For my love and passion for fashion, I started this venture. Uh, I used to be very interested in making dresses and making accessories. In fact, I grew up fixing my sister's and my cousin's wardrobe. And before I officially started jewelry making, I used to make dresses for models and for fashion shows, photo shows, and beauty pageants. The idea of making and selling was started way back in 2017 and while I was in my final year. I used to make a few pair of earrings uh, from unconventional material like buttons, stone pills that I got from old jewelry and old clothes like taken in. And I sell them to my classmates, to my friends, and they love it as much as I love making them. And that's how uh, from one pair, two pair, that multiply into more and that's how the cycle of making and selling starts. Meanwhile, starting this new venture, I have been very fortunate enough to have met Julia Asen, the owner and the founder of Fusion Stores in Auckland, who guided and encouraged me into the business world and for that I am very really grateful to her as well as to her team for all the love and all the support and all the exposure they have given me. Being an entrepreneur, of course, there are advantages as well as disadvantages. I think the advantage are for me the working hour because I can be working anytime at my own flexible and convenient timing. And I can be at my own creative pace because there is no one to control over me. And for disadvantages, I think generally the market is very slow and we have less exposure. I think that's what I had to say about the disadvantages of being an entrepreneur. If anyone is starting something, especially in this field, I want you to have the sense of authenticity because that is one of the best one piece of advice I can give you. I think in Nagaland the jewelry market is booming, uh, be it the established or 
the upcoming, everyone is doing great in their own creations. And for that, I respect their work and their dedication. So everyone is my favorite community. If you are one of them, give it up. Guess what? This is a very interesting question. <laughs> uh, I have made a lot of clients. Some are very nice and some are not so nice, but that's okay. And the worst client experience I hate would be um, I mean, those clients who order customized pieces, be it necklace, be it earring, or brooch, and be after like putting all my sweat, all my effort, and after making the pieces, they're not fine. I mean, no response. I think that's the worst experience. Sour? I have so many crush, but currently I'm crushing on Aurora. I want to give this short message to all the viewers out there. Always recognize your true creativeness, explore it, and work on it without listening to any naysayers. Thank you so much Zaben for being a part of today's interview. Despite our busy schedule, uh, we have put so much effort to make this work. And this interview is mostly possible because you have sacrificed your time and you've put your, so much effort into making this uh, interview work. So thank you so much and God bless you. Uh, continue to be creative, continue to be experimental like you always are. And I see you rising higher and higher in life. Uh, and guys, uh, please, uh, check and follow his page uh, if you really like the following items then you can place your order you can also place customized order and yes there are so many critics out there who might say when when i say support local then you you might question saying it as uh, support local expensive uh, if you check his items and if you check his pricing then it is very reasonable in so many ways so don't miss out on that and yes thank you so much for watching this video i'll be uploading more videos in the coming weeks so you need to stay tuned to my channel if you don't want to miss out on that so thank you so much once again take care stay safe and bye everyone